Actress Sue Lyon made a big impact in movies, leaving lasting memories for many people. What's your favorite movie or scene of hers? We'd love to hear your stories about what you love most about this classic actor. And stick around for some interesting facts about Sue Lyon. Your thoughts and stories are important to us. Sue Lyon hailed from Davenport, Iowa, and had an ordinary childhood much like other kids. Growing up in a supportive family, Sue's early years were filled with school friends and family outings. Back then, there were no signs that she would step into the world of acting. As a teenager, Sue caught the attention of a Hollywood filmmaker who recognized her potential. This led to her landing the role of Lolita in the film adaptation of Vladimir Nabokov's novel, a pivotal moment that marked the start of her acting journey. The fame that followed Sue's portrayal of Lolita brought both opportunities and challenges. Navigating the complexities of early fame was no easy feat, but Sue persevered, continuing to work in the entertainment industry. She appeared in various films and television shows, showcasing her talent and determination. Despite the seemingly ordinary start to her life, Sue Lyon's talent set her apart. The role of Lolita opened doors for her, shaping a successful acting career. The journey was marked by opportunities and challenges, all of which contributed to her growth in the industry. In the film The Night of the Iguana, the famously hairy-chested Richard Burton had to undergo a complete body waxing before sharing a swimming scene with her. Back in 1960, she was selected as Miss Smile by Los Angeles County Dentists. Then, in 1962, she gained further recognition for her role as Lolita in the movie of the same name. Following her success, she released a hit single called Ya Ya Lolita, which featured a Latin instrumental combined with her repeated ya ya's. These accomplishments mark key moments in her career, showcasing both her acting talent and her brief foray into music. In the movie adaptation, Sue Lyon played the infamous character Lolita when she was just 14 years old, though in the original novel, Lolita was depicted as only 12 and a half. Her performance sparked discussions about portraying such a controversial character at her age. After her time in the limelight, she led a more private life. She married former football player Roland Harrison, and the couple welcomed a daughter named Nona Merrill Harrison. Nona was born on May 20, 1972 in Los Angeles. Sue's focus shifted towards family life, and she graduated from Palisades High School in 1990. Before her acting career as a child, Sue modeled for J.C. Penney catalogs, showcasing her talent from a young age. This early experience likely contributed to her comfort in front of the camera later on. Sue's journey from portraying Lolita to embracing motherhood and pursuing education highlights her versatility and resilience in the entertainment industry, navigating various roles on and off screen with grace. After attending Al, the City College, Sue Lyon worked in a men's clothing store. However, her life took a drastic turn when she and her mother were in a severe car accident on the Pacific Coast Highway. This accident left her with head, neck, and back injuries, forcing her in and out of a wheelchair for two years. Despite this setback, she remained determined. During her younger years, she formed a friendship with Michelle Phillips. Together, they ventured into the library and borrowed a copy of the controversial novel Lolita, knowing it had been banned. Sue found the book too complex to finish, reflecting her age at the time. Despite the challenges she faced, Sue Lyon's resilience and curiosity defined her journey, shaping her into the person she became. After finishing filming Shelley Winters, Sue Lyon's co-star in Lolita, gave her two pink Persian kittens once owned by Elizabeth Taylor. During the shoot, Lyon, who played Lolita, rode horses every day. Director Stanley Kubrick advised her to roll over if thrown from the horse to protect her face. Before Lolita, Lyon played a similar character in an episode of the Loretta Young show called Alien Love, where she flirted with an older male teacher, causing problems. Her experience in such roles likely helped her in Lolita. In her role as Lolita in the film adaptation of the same name, she encountered some health setbacks. Sue Lyon missed four days of filming due to tonsillitis, briefly halting production. Despite this hiccup, her portrayal of Lolita marked her debut in the world of cinema. However, her age barred her from attending the New York premiere in June 62. Yet, she was granted permission to grace the London premiere at the Columbia Theatre in September. These incidents, though challenging, underscore Lyon's early experiences in the industry. In the shadows of her life lie some poignant realities. Her older brother met a tragic end, succumbing to an overdose in Tijuana, Mexico. This sorrowful event was a somber chapter in her personal history. However, amidst the challenges, she found herself surrounded by three surviving older siblings, showing the strength of her family ties. Family, though shattered by loss, remained a strong theme in her journey. 
Beyond the glitz of Hollywood, she was involved in a unique part of her life, a fundraiser for Synanon. Little did she know that the organization, initially a benign initiative, would later morph into a full-fledged cult. The details of her involvement in this early chapter of Synanon's history add a layer of interest to her narrative. In her life story, these lesser-known aspects provide a glimpse into the complexities that shaped her. From personal tragedies to unwitting connections with organizations taking unexpected turns, her story extends beyond the spotlight, revealing the many sides of a life lived in both light and shadow. In Sue Lyon's life, marriage often met an abrupt end. With the exception of her first and last marriages, the rest dissolved within a year. She made a notable mark in cinema, particularly in her portrayal of Lolita, a character envisioned differently by author Vladimir Nabokov. Initially, Nabokov deemed Sue Lyon fitting for the role, but later mused that Catherine Demijot might have been the perfect choice. One of Lyon's significant roles was as Charlotte Goodall in The Night of the Iguana. The filming took place in September 1963, where she worked alongside John Huston and Richard Burton with Elizabeth Taylor in tow. Houston, captivated by the area's allure, invested in a house in a cottage colony nearby, drawn by the region's fishing opportunities. Following her passing, she chose a unique and serene resting place as she was cremated, and her daughter took on the poignant task of scattering her ashes in the vast expanse of the Pacific Ocean. This symbolic act echoed her deep connection with the sea, perhaps seeking a perpetual embrace by the ways she admired. In the movie world, she left a lasting impression with her role as Charlotte Goodall in The Night of the Iguana. During filming, a significant presence joined her on set. Her then fiancé decided to be by her side. Unfortunately, his enthusiastic involvement led to director John Huston banning him from the production. It added a layer of drama off-screen, mirroring the intensity captured within the film. Beyond her acting career, she made meaningful contributions off-camera. She demonstrated her compassionate side by establishing a charity named Supixink. While the charity was under her brief management, it reflected her commitment to making a positive difference in the world, showcasing a side of her that extended beyond Hollywood's glitz and glamour. In her life, her journey was marked by unique moments, both on and off the screen. The scattering of her ashes in the vast Pacific serves as a poetic ending to a life that touched many. As we reflect on her legacy, it's clear that her influence goes beyond the role she played, encapsulating a spirit that transcends time. In 1968, she backed Eugene McCarthy for president, showing her growing interest in politics during a turbulent time. She also acted in a movie called Alligator, playing an ABC newswoman. This role showed she could play different characters. It's interesting to note that this movie was the last one for both Dean Jagger and her, which adds a sad note to her career. Warren Beatty thought about casting her as Bonnie Parker in Bonnie and Clyde, a famous movie. People were really interested in seeing her play such a big role. But Beatty chose Faye Dunaway instead, which changed her career in Hollywood. These almost casting moments show how unpredictable the movie business can be. For her, it reminded her that luck plays a big part in acting careers. Thinking about these missed chances makes you wonder how things might have been different if she had gotten the part. Even though she didn't, her work still leaves a lasting impact on movie history. In the movie Lolita, the lead character, portrayed by Sue Lyon, received praise for her performance, winning the Most Promising Female Newcomer Award at the 1963 Golden Globes. Despite her success in acting, she faced personal challenges, being diagnosed with manic depression and prescribed lithium. She opened up about struggling with this condition since she was 16. After marrying Richard Rudman, she decided to step away from acting. This marked a new chapter in her life, focusing on different interests outside of the spotlight. During her retirement, she explored new hobbies and dedicated time to personal growth. Although she left Hollywood, her memorable performances continued to be remembered, and she made a lasting impression on audiences worldwide. Her journey, filled with triumphs and struggles, remains inspiring to many, reminding us of the complexities of life. Despite the passage of time, her story continues to connect with people today. This brief glimpse into her life offers just a glimpse of the depth and richness of her story, a story that continues to touch hearts. Sue Lyon's portrayal of Lolita in the movie Lolita is memorable. In one scene, she's shown watching The Curse of Frankenstein at a drive-in theater, where Christopher Lee reveals himself as the monster, frightening her. Interestingly, about 15 years later, she acted alongside him in the movie End of the World. It's fascinating how actors can come full circle in their careers, isn't it? Her journey from being scared by Lee on screen to working with him shows the unpredictability of Hollywood. 
This progression shows how connections can develop within the industry. It's a reminder of how relationships and collaborations in filmmaking can change over time. Such instances offer a glimpse into the dynamic and always changing world of Hollywood where paths intersect and diverge in unexpected ways. Her experience highlights the variety of experiences throughout a performer's career, showing the dance between fear and familiarity, separation and reunion. In the end, it's these connections and experiences that shape the stories both on and off the screen, leaving a lasting impression on audiences worldwide. Indeed, the journey from being captivated by a screen presence to sharing it is a special one, showing the lasting appeal of cinema and its ability to bring people together in surprising ways. In a surprising turn of events, Sue Lyon, known for her role in Lolita, faced tough times later in life despite her early success in Hollywood. Financial struggles and legal battles followed her retirement from acting, leading to bankruptcy and disputes over money. These challenges overshadowed her once promising career, showing the harsh realities of fame. Despite the hardships, her talent and work in film remain undeniable, leaving a lasting impression on the industry. Despite the trials she faced, her story endures as a reminder of the complexities of stardom. Her journey serves as a cautionary tale highlighting the importance of navigating fame with caution and resilience. Behind the silver screen, there's a human with struggles and triumphs just like anyone else. In a surprising twist, the actress Sue Lyon, known for her roles in memorable films, faced tough times later in life. Despite her success in movies, her later years were marked by difficulties. She encountered financial problems and health issues. After her standout performances in films like Lolita and Night of the Iguana, Lyon's career gradually declined. The once prominent actress found herself caught in legal and financial troubles, a big change from the glitzy world of Hollywood. This unexpected downturn led to a quieter phase in her life. As time went on, Lyon's health became a concern. Dealing with various health problems, she faced hardships away from the spotlight. The once vibrant actress, who had charmed audiences with her performances, now struggled with personal challenges far from her earlier glamorous life. Looking back, Sue Lyon's later years serve as a reminder of how fame and fortune can be unpredictable. Despite her earlier success in acting, her later life took an unfortunate turn. In a tragic turn of events, the life of the actress took a somber path after her rise to fame. Despite her early success, she encountered personal struggles that overshadowed her later years. Amid her notable accomplishments in the film industry, her life was marked by a sorrowful revelation. Following retirement from acting, she faced financial difficulties and health challenges, leading to a period of seclusion. Despite the praise she received during her career, her later life was marred by adversity, highlighting the complexities of fame and fortune. Her journey, including her portrayal in Lolita and other significant roles, serves as a poignant reminder of the highs and lows that come with a life in the spotlight. Surprisingly, the actress known for her role in Lolita had a tough personal life. Despite looking young on screen, her private life was full of problems and sadness. She got married five times, but each marriage ended in divorce. This made her career difficult because she had personal issues behind the scenes. After her troubled relationships, she often felt better when she was acting. It helped her forget about her personal problems. But the hard times she went through in her marriages affected her a lot, making her struggle not only with her feelings, but also with her career. As she dealt with being famous, people saw her as a happy person in public, but she was going through a lot in private. Fans loved her on screen, but knowing about her problems off screen made people think more about her. Even though she faced many challenges, she was strong in the entertainment world. She was great at playing different characters, even though she had tough times behind the scenes. Her story shows how someone can be successful in public, but still have problems in private. In the end, what she left behind showed how people can be strong even when they have tough times. Her journey, with its ups and downs, shows that even famous people can have big problems behind closed doors. This story about the actress from Lolita is a good example of how fame can hide struggles. Following her breakthrough role in Lolita, Sue Lyon encountered various personal challenges later in life. Despite her early success, she faced financial difficulties and struggled with health issues. Unfortunately, she experienced multiple divorces, which added to her hardships. These later years were quite different from the initial spotlight she enjoyed as a young actress. It's a reminder that fame doesn't always guarantee a smooth journey. Her life took unexpected turns, showcasing the complexities behind the glamorous facade of Hollywood. This demonstrates that even those who experience early success in the entertainment industry can face significant obstacles later on. 
Such narratives shed light on the often overlooked struggles that accompany fame and fortune, offering a more nuanced perspective on the lives of public figures. In a tragic twist of fate, Sue Lyon's life took a sorrowful turn post-stardom. Despite gaining fame early in her career, she encountered personal challenges that marred her later years. After her Hollywood success waned, she faced financial struggles and battled health issues. This once promising star faced a stark contrast to her glamorous on-screen persona, highlighting the harsh realities that can accompany fame. Despite the adversity she faced, her legacy as an actress endures, reminding us of the unpredictable nature of life in the spotlight. Amidst Sue Lyon's career, a somber note emerges her struggle with alcoholism. Despite her early success and talent, she battled alcohol addiction, which sadly overshadowed her later years. She faced personal demons, leading to a downward spiral in her life, ultimately impacting her career and relationships. Her story serves as a reminder of the challenges many face behind the glamour of Hollywood. Lyon's battle with alcoholism stands as a poignant reminder of the often unseen struggles of those in the spotlight. It's a tragic chapter in the life of a talented actress, highlighting the importance of addressing mental health and addiction issues. In an unexpected turn of events, Sue Lyon, known for her role in Lolita, faced a heartbreaking reality in her personal life. Despite her charm and talent on screen, she experienced difficult relationships, one of which ended tragically. Amidst her fame in Hollywood, she dealt with the loss of her husband to suicide. This sad event overshadowed her life, revealing the deeper struggles behind the glamour of fame. Despite these challenges, she persisted in her career, leaving a lasting impression on cinema. Her journey reminds us of the profound human experiences that often lie beneath the surface of stardom. Her story resonates with many, serving as a poignant reminder of the complexities of life in the limelight. Despite the applause and adoration from fans, she grappled with personal demons that ultimately shaped her narrative beyond the silver screen. Her resilience in the face of adversity is a powerful example of the strength of the human spirit, inspiring generations to come. As we reflect on her life and career, we are reminded that behind every Hollywood star, there is a story of triumph and tribulation. Her enduring impact lives on, immortalized in the characters she portrayed and the hearts she touched. Her journey serves as a beacon of hope for those navigating their own struggles in the pursuit of their dreams.